Super Duper Grim are, well, myself, um, Alistair Hamer, uh, who plays the drums, um, he works the loop pedal, he plays the harmonium, um, and then if he's got any other limbs spare, we give him other things to do as well. We've got Anthony Bishop, who plays the bass guitar um, and the banjo, backing vocals. Um, we're helped out by David Priest, uh, who plays keyboards and the accordion. Uh, yeah, and we're uh, just about to introduce our laptop into proceedings as well, which should make things even more complicated. I, well, I mean, I prefer, obviously, uh, uh, recording complex and uh, storage facility, but uh, no, it is a shed. It is a shed, there's no denying it. Um, part of my path into middle age. Yeah, so this is, this is, uh, this is where it all happened. Um, uh, and I would sneak down here when the kids were asleep, uh, when I got back from work earlier than expected. Um, uh, just somewhere to kind of um, fiddle about with those sounds I have in my head, to try and turn them into something. Um, also a place to store all the musical junk without making myself very unpopular in, uh, at home. Down there there's a, uh, um, a biscuit tin that provided percussion uh, for the last thing I did. Um, there is a couple of dustbin lids that I saved from a skip um, that sound amazing when they're bowed. Um, I have a broken toy piano. I have um, a child's plastic guitar, which stays in tune for four or five seconds at a time, if you're lucky. Um, but they all make noises that people would be very hard pressed to kind of know what they are, and that's kind of what appeals to me about them. It's not, a, it's not a sound you're going to hear on anyone else's record. Or it wasn't until I obviously told everyone what they were. But uh, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's an inspiring place to be, despite being um, kind of small, uh, not having any natural light, um, and either being far too hot or really cold. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's my shed and I love it. So... Mm -hmm.